Hello and welcome fellow YouTubers. After I went through all the factory sounds yesterday on my new XMG300M modeler, I decided to do some sound editing today. Therefore I went to the new FX homepage and downloaded the sound editor software and also as it is recommended in the manual, tried some firmware update. I downloaded the NUX device updater, but oops, when I tried to open it, my macOS gave a system alert. It would not trust this program. How to solve this problem? You go to the system settings on your macOS, click the tab security, and then at the very first tab again, on my German language macOS called Allgemein, your macOS tells you that it allows apps only from the App Store or verified developers. But there's also the alert that the new X device updater could not be opened. But you can click and tell your macOS, please open it, it's a trusted program. The next step then is, of course, to have your MG300 connected via USB. Unplug the power connector. Push and hold both foot switches, replug the power connector again and you can see the display changes and it's waiting for the firmware update. Start the new X device updater, select the latest firmware file, it's in the same folder you just downloaded and start the update. 20 seconds later, big problem, heart attack and the reason why us guitarists prefer analog devices. <laughs> the firmware update could not be done successfully, maybe because my MG300 hardware unit already had the latest firmware or maybe whatever, some other reasons. Don't even understand why they recommend to do the firmware update. Anyway, now the only chance you have you can only stop the program, stop the process and unplug, replug the power adapter again and hope your MG300 is still working fine. And yeah, lucky me. It seems to be still okay and working fine. So okay, no problem, no firmware update. Then let's go for the editor software. Click the download link, download it and install it. And as expected, it gave the same system alert that this quick tone is it called program or app from new X could not be trusted. Yep, there it is. But okay, we already know what to do. Go to your system settings, click the security tab and tell your Mac OS that you trust the new X Quick Tone app. And oops, there it is. Quick Tone version 1.0.6.16. And you're up to some sound editing. That's what I'm gonna do in the next video. Thanks for watching. I hope you did not experience the same trouble I went through. But if so, you can see in this video how to easily solve it. See you later, see you at the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye bye.